How's it going guys? Welcome back to another Destiny 2 video. So Bungie earlier today finally broke silence and decided that it was time after all the outcry to nerf the Lost Forges. Yes, it's only been out a day, but the power level requirements were simply too high. At 615, people couldn't even jump into it and only the few that actually grinded their hearts out were able to complete the challenge. Well, as of about 2-3 hours ago, Bungie decided that it was time, server side, to reduce the requirements by 5 power levels for all tiers. So where you had the first encounter at 615, then the second encounter at 625, and the third encounter at 630, it's now going to be 610, 620 and 625. Now earlier today, as you can see in this video, we went in with a random, there was me, a friend and a random, and we pretty much were able to almost complete the second challenge with wayward weapons. If we had actually infused our best weapons, we would have pretty much beaten this phase as well. With that said, I think this change is a positive one, it was a needed one, and people now should at least have a better chance of accessing the content and a little bit better chance of actually beating the content. Previously it was inaccessible, but now at least it is accessible. You're able to access what you've paid for. For those people that are below the 600 power level, some are even at 530, 40, well Bungie had this to say to you. This response doesn't answer all your questions. There are still many of you asking how you can catch up and acquire the power you need to join the quests to recover these lost forges. The answers to those questions are coming. We have some existing plans and some new ideas in the pipeline. That conversation will continue tomorrow in This Week at Bungie. Pretty much, tomorrow's tribe will cover how they're planning on getting people caught up. I assume the easiest way and the most simplest way is to increase the soft cap from 500 to say 580. I mean this is the most logical thing they can do and it absolutely makes sense that they should do something like this. Even if they increase the soft cap to 600 at this point, it will enable people to grind out in the open world, it will get people rushing out doing all sorts of content because at that point they are powering up all the way to 600. So I think the easiest way for them to do this is to increase the soft cap. Why they didn't do that in the first place I don't know, but that's pretty much this video. I will be having an impressions video and it's pretty much going to be an angry one. So do look forward to it. But in the end, in my opinion, this change is a good one and that's the end of this PSA. Lost Forge was nerfed within one day and is now accessible. Go in there and get your loot. Remain Legend.